Hey, yo! Today, no gameplay, no reviews. We are going with the 100% the most accurate and the most picks that make sense but today we got our team of the year prediction and i think i am right with every single one because they make the most sense first let's start at a quarterback and you already know i'm going with dangerous russell wilson now you guys are probably saying, why not Lamar Jackson? Why not Lamar? Lamar's going to get an NFL Honors card. He's going to get MVP. So why would you give him a Team of the Year card and then give him an NFL Honor card? Russ was the second best quarterback in the NFL. He's my quarterback for Team of the Year. If you don't see it, something's got to be wrong with you. Now with the halfback position... I'm going with Derrick Henry. He's need a, he needs an upgrade. He needs an upgrade. Bad. 91 team of the week. He just killed the Patriots in the playoffs, too. I'm glad. You guys are probably wondering, why not McCaffrey? He just got a zero chill card. Derrick Henry gets it. You are the halfback for team of the year, my boy. For fullback, Kyle Juszczyk. He gets one all the time. Well, he got one last year. And before that was James Devlin. But, oh my, I, I remember that mean stiff arm he gave to Minka Fitzpatrick. He's a playmaker at fullback, though. For wide receiver, D-Hop. This is based off of the NFL all pro team first team d hop made that i bet you guys are wondering like why not julio jones julio just got a card he just got a card and then for the other receiver michael thomas this is a clear choice he hasn't had an upgrade since most feared the 92 91 overall or 92 but those are my receivers for team of the year. Can't guard Mike. He's breaking so many records, too. It's an easy choice. Now, for tight end, my favorite tight end in the NFL, George Kittle. I can't wait. I'm definitely going to get this card. I definitely am. I'm already preparing for team of the year right now. But George Kittle's the best tight end in the league. Travis Kelsey just got a card, so it's definitely George Kittle. Congrats, you are my team of the year tight end, George. Now, for the offensive lineman, I was kind of confused here. I'm going off of cards that need upgrades and the NFL All-Pro team. David Bakhtiari, you are the left tackle for team of the year. It's a clear choice. Left guard, oh, I'm always, I always have trouble saying his name. Joel Batonio. He got one last year, I think. And he hasn't had an upgrade since my heroes. You are the left guard for team of the year. I bet you guys are wondering, like, Quentin Nelson? Quentin Nelson is a choice, too. Definitely look out for him. Center, I was going to say Jason Kelsey. But I forgot he got that 94-0 chill card. So I looked at the all-pro team. Rodney Hudson was second he was the second team. Yeah. So I'm going with Rodney Husson for our center. That would be a nice card. He hasn't had an upgrade in a while. 87. Get him to upgrade to 95. Right guard. Everybody's favorite choice. Zach Martin. I wish he was the Castro, but... Didn't have a good as a year as Zach Martin. You are my right guard team of the year. Congrats. Zach Martin. 
He's always having a beast card. Now for right tackle, this was hard. A hard choice. I was going Ryan Ramchek, but it might be him. But I'm going with Mr. Swartz. Didn't get that playoff captain like I thought he was. I'm going with Mitchell Swartz. Now for the defensive side of the ball. This is my worst pick out of all of them. I did not know who to pick. So I just picked Demarcus Lawrence. He's only had four sacks through the year. I know, I know, guys. This is a hard pick. I do not know who to pick for left end. Danielle Hunter just got a card. But Grady Jarrett is my D tackle. He made the all pro team. Second team, I think. Yeah, he made the second team for interior lineman. You are the D tackle for team of the year. And my favorite defensive tackle in the league. DeForest Buckner. All pro second team. Welcome to team of the year. You are the D tackle. Now for our left, no, right in, my fault. Clear choice. Aaron Donald is a beast. Welcome to team of the year. Give him a 96, 95, whatever you guys are going to get him. He's going to be a beast card. I'm ready for it. For the left outside linebacker, you already know who I'm going with. I'm going with my boy, my favorite player, TJ Watt. He is a defensive player of the year candidate. He made the first team. All pro first team. As an edge rusher. Amazing year. Pro Bowl. Give it to him. Middle linebacker, like always, Bobby Wagner. First team all pro. Give him that upgrade to a 97, 96. Last year he was a 98. Now for our right outside linebacker. I think this will sell. And it's the most deserved. Chandler Jones had an amazing year. His highest card is not 90? Limited time, I think. Give him an upgrade. He needs it. Now, cornerback, Chadavius White. Didn't get the playoff captain like he was supposed to. He's our team of the year corner. Now, people are saying Jalen Ramsey. No, I'm not giving it to Ramsey. He didn't do anything except get himself traded. But Marlon Humphrey had a breakout year. When he punched that ball out of Juju's hands, he made me mad, but that was a great play. He is my second corner for team of the year. You could give it to Richard Sherman. First team all pro, he can be one. He stepped up this year. The 49ers stepped up and he did also. But where is he at? Let me, Marcus Peters. Marcus Peters got things done. Where you at? There he is. Oh, he just got a zero chill card. 93. Why not? Throw him in there. Look out for Joe Hayden too. I'll give I'll give one to Joe Hayden also. Those are my cornerbacks. Strong safety. People will say Honey Badger, but first team All Pro. I'm going with that list. Jamal Adams. Everybody wants a new Jamal Adams. Hasn't got a card since. Mutt Heroes. I think we need a new Jamal Adams. This is a clear choice. People think it's Justin Simmons. I know Justin Simmons deserves a card. He'll get one soon, but it won't be team of the year. Pro Bowler. 
First team all pro Minka Fitzpatrick. More touchdowns than Odell, a wide receiver. This man deserves a card. This card will sell packs. This card will make the market crash. It will be the best free safety in the game. But that is my prediction for Team of the Year. I hope you guys liked it. Go get power-ups for these cards. Subscribe if you're new. Like, comment, share. I can't wait. I got so many gameplays for Team of the Year coming out. I'm getting ready for it right now. I'm out. Peace.